I'm going to demonstrate tail pulls and tail circles. Molly suffered a spinal cord injury. She was actually shot in her spine, which left her paralyzed and from about here on down just completely flaccid, so her tail didn't really work and obviously her back feet didn't either. Um, with tail pulls and tail circles, you want to think that the same nerves that innervate all the way to the end of the tail also innervate the feet. So when you've got a hind limb paralysis, tail pulls and tail circles can actually help the nerves that feed the feet as well. So what you want to do is really gently take two hands at the base of the tail and just gently pull and do circles. So you want to do five, ten times in one direction, five, ten times in the other direction. Um, and you can also massage the tail going all the way down to the tip which helps with dogs who've got neurological problems. The other thing that you wanna do is, is gentle rocking. So tail rocking back and forth really gently is a great exercise for dogs who have any kind of hind limb paralysis. And it should actually feel good too.